Ronnie, we have target area today. Let's get, well, that we're gonna need some dumbbells or some sort of weight to use. So we're gonna start with some heel two bucks spins. Let's go. Heel two bucks. Three, two, one, knees up. Three, two, one, opposite arm, opposite knee, squeeze up high, four, three, two, one, tip and scoop, so straight back, straight legs, three, two, one, toy soldier, opposite hand to foot, four, three, two, one, Bend and reach. Don't forget to start your uh, watches. Three, two, one. Up on the toes. So we'll transfer weight from side to side. Roll out the wrists. Three, two, and one. Grab a spot. Swing the legs. Three, two. One, change leg, three, two, one, ankle rotation, little circles, go the other way, go the other way, let's go, big reach, pull down, two more, two, one, let's go to wood chop, pull diagonally, other side, one, hinge, not too low, keep it tight, two, one, let's go a little hip rotation, two, one, go the other way, two, and one, open the chest, two, one, little circles, gradually getting bigger and bigger, two, and one, go the other way, Small first, two, nice and big, three, two, one, cross the hands over, two, one, reach, big stretch above the head, let's go to a wrist rotation, sit back, two, one, okay, our first target area is our legs, option to use weight, so grab some dumbbells, um, I would go relatively heavy, but you need to be able to keep good form, okay? So, we're going to start with a weighted split squat, which is basically a lunge, another word for a lunge. We're going to stay on this leg for one round, 30 seconds. Drop down that back leg as low as you can. Drop and bend. So today we're going to do legs, whoop, chest, and back. So it's only going to be a short session. Okay, switching sides. When you're strength training, oh, sorry, you've got 15 seconds rest here. I forgot about the rest. You should always work both sides of your body. Well, it doesn't have to be in the same workout, but at least within the week. We don't want to get muscle imbalances. This is exercise two. Woo. Four exercises, and then there's a target move, which we're going to do on its own for four rounds. Drop down. Okay, dumbbells down for the next one. We have got double decker. So that is a squat, backward stepping lunge. So 15 second rest here. Squat, backward stepping lunge. Let's go. Drop, make sure your knees and toes are lined up when you step back. Drop it back. This is exercise three. Squat. Drop back. Draw the 
this one double decker. Okay, number four. Weights are optional. At the shoulders, sumo. You've got still got rest here. Shh. Sumo. Shh. With a pulse. So we're going to sit back in that extra wide squat, and we're going to pulse. Make sure from the side you've still got that natural curve in the lower back. Work guys. Stay down, chest up, shoulders back. Come on, eight seconds, almost there. Those legs are burning. Bring it up. We have 20 seconds rest and we're moving to our target move, which is going to be rebound squat jumps. So we come down, halfway up, down, pull back. Chelsea, be quiet, please. Let's go. Down, halfway up. So little breathe down bounce. And add a jump. And that's it. So it's down, halfway up, down, pull back. Take a break, guys. We've got four rounds, so three, one down, three left. 20 seconds work, 10 seconds rest. Let's go. Little rebound bounce. So down, up, down, and jump. Come on. You can do it. Rest, shake your legs, two left. And we're going to do each round twice. So all the way back to the start after this. Come on, you can do it, nearly there. Okay, great, one more. And then we're back to our split squat. Let's go. Pull back. That's it. Come on. Try and get some air under those feet. We can do it. Oh. Okay, 20 seconds break. Get your dumbbells again, please. Back to our, or unless you're going body weight, that's fine. So we have our split squat. We've actually got, yep, we're starting now. Drop down, bend that back leg, shoulders back, head up. Work guys, drop that back leg as low as you can, nearly there, 15 seconds to change sides, have a quick break, okay, drop it back, let's go. Drop down, straighten it up. Bend that back leg, bring it as low as you can. Shoulders back, dumbbells are nice and steady by your side. Okay, weights down, back to double decker. Squat lunge, squat lunge. You've got 15 seconds rest though. Okay, let's go. Squat, drop back. Squat, drop back. That's 
set. Come on. Yes, please stop banging around in there. I'm taping here. Now I've got the animal Zoe. Sorry, guys. Live taping session. Okay, break. Dumbbells. Option. If you want the dumbbells for our sumo pulse. Wait for it. Two, one. Let's go. So we're coming to the bottom of the movement and just pulsing down and up. Come on. You can do it. Pulse, pulse. Legs on fire. Come on. That's why we call it target area. Because we're targeting that one area. Two, one. Okay, 20 seconds break. And then we're going to our target move, which is our rebound squat jumps. Okay. Are you ready? 20 seconds. Let's go. Down, halfway up, down. Pull back. Try to get some air under those feet if you can. Now my animal's a bit naughty. Right, 10 seconds. Three rounds left. Two, one, let's go. Come on. Rebound, bounce at the bottom, down, halfway up, down, pull back. Come on, you can do it. I know those legs are burning, you're doing so well. Great, two to go. Then we're moving to our chest. Okay, let's go. Now a little rebound bounce. Come on. Oh, one more guys. Ooh, quick shake, quick break. Let's go. Come on, last one. You can do it. Finish off. Five seconds. Woo, 20 second rest. This time we're targeting our chest. Okay. Four moves. We're going to start with walkout press ups. Okay, let's go. Oh, actually, sorry, you've got 10 seconds rest. I'll show you the move. Okay, time starts now. Walk out, press up, bend the knees, come in. You go again. Touch your toes. Come on, 30 seconds. That's it. Push, guys. Okay, next we have floor press. So, Remember with this exercise, our elbows go back towards our hips. So we're not coming too wide with those elbows. You can afford to go a little bit heavier with this one if you've done it before. Bring it up over the bottom of the chest, top of the ribs. Bend those elbows towards the hips. Great work. And next two, 
we're going to go lighter, okay? So come up. Next one is push and pull. You can't go too heavy with this one. It's like what we just did, except we're standing. Let's go. So we bring it out and in. That's it. Out and line with the chest. Pull back. I'd go three at the most, maybe two. That's it. Come on. Three. Two. Awesome. Maybe slightly heavier with this one, but not if you haven't done it before. So we're going to pack deck. We start here. Elbows at that 90 degree angle. We pull the elbows together and then open the chest. But we do not go past the belt body. Stop here. Elbows together. Open the chest. I've gone too heavy. I'm gonna change weights. Here, that's better. Elbows together without pulling the whole back together. Keep the back straight and still. Okay, targeted move guys. We're going to do a walkout press up with a shoulder tap. So we've got four. Rounds, 20 seconds work. Let's go. So we do our push up or press up, whatever you want to call it. And then we go two shoulder taps, walk in, touch the toes, go again. Two controlled shoulder taps. Have a rest here, quick stretch. Two more rounds. Let's go. So we touch our toes, come out, press up, then two controlled shoulder taps. You can go on the feet if you can. A bit tough after all those other chest exercises. Right? Halfway. Two left. Two, one, let's go. Walk out, press up, two shoulder taps. Come on, let's go. We can do it. One left, quick 10 second break, and then we're going back to the start. Let's go, walk out, press up, two shoulder taps, touch the toes, go again, come on, last round, awesome, so now we're back to the start, have a quick chest stretch. Back to just the prep, walk out, press up. That's our first 30 second exercise. Two, one, let's go. So just the press up, no shoulder tap this time. Come in, touch the toes, go again. Go to the knees if you're feeling a bit fatigued in the chest, still gonna be tough. Whole body moves together, shoulders and hips, head stays in line with the spine, come on, okay, grabbing your dumbbells that can be a little heavier because it's a compound move that works more than one muscle group, let's go, drop down, Exhale, when you press up, breathe it out, come on, 
Last round of chest. Then we're going to move on to back. Stop banging, please, Chelsea. Great work, guys. Come on. Well done. Let's bring it up. So we're going to our push pull. So going down in weight to probably about three kilos. Brace the core. Standing still. Press out in front. Pull back. Come on. Up exercise, standing up. Make sure you're not going too high. Come out. Get in line with the chest. Well done. Okay, next one, pec deck. Okay, so remember I went too heavy last time. Don't go too heavy. This one, you don't go too far back. So keep our arms in that peripheral vision. Keep our elbows up at 90 degrees. Don't let them come down. Don't let them go up too high. Come on. Keep going. This is killer. Come on, guys. Finish off. Radio, going to our hard move. I'm going to change it this round. We're going to our heavy chest press to finish our, off our chest. Okay, so you can go a bit heavier with this one. Two, one, let's go. So four rounds, 20 seconds, but only as heavy as you can and still be able to control that weight. So only 20 seconds work, 10 seconds rest, four rounds. This is our target move. Break, 10 seconds, three rounds to go. Radio, let's go, round two. Last round of chest, guys. We're gonna move on to back next. Drop down, straight out the arms, but leave a slight bend in the elbows. You don't want to fully lock out our arms. Break. Two down, two to go. Let's get ready. Exhale as you press. This is round three. Come on, off chest. This is our target move for this round. Change it up from the last round. Breathe out when you press up. Have a break. I'm going to stay here, challenge myself. Keep the dumbbells up. You don't have to. Two, one. Last round. Let's go. Try to exhale as you press. Come on. That chest is screaming, finish it off. And done, okay. Moving to back next, guys. So we're gonna start with a renegade row first. When the buzzer goes, we've got another 10 seconds. Okay, so 10 seconds, and then we're starting with our 30 second round. Okay, let's go, squeeze up. Renegade, alternating, elbows come up past the ribs. Come on, we can do it. Going. Okay, dumbbells to the side. We have sea turtles next. 
So squeeze the glutes. We pull elbows back. And then we squeeze our shoulder blades back and down. Come on. Let's go, let's go. Squeeze back. Keep those eyes down so you're not straining that neck. Jumping up. This time we have a full PUL complex. So we tip, we do a row, we stand up and curl. Let's go. One row. Stand up, bicep curl. Tip, row, stand up, curl. Come on, curl. That's it. Five seconds. Okay. Next one, hopefully I've got my kettlebell there, have I? No, I haven't. I'll do a deadlift. So, this time we, we hinge at the hips, push through the heels, all right. So we hinge, push through the heels. Tip, tip, tip. Weave it up. If you can't do this one, put your hands behind your head, uh, back, and practice a bow, like you're bowing to the queen. Push through the heels. That'll probably be a bit late, Chi. Hmm? Okay, so our target move seems very simple, but you're gonna feel it quite quickly. It's called a back extension. So we're here, our thumbs are up, our head is down. We are lifting our shoulder blades together. So our thumbs are not forwards or back. They're coming straight up. And we're lifting up from the shoulder blades. Come on. Straight up from the shoulder blades. Break. I'm going to turn around this way now. It's round two. Okay, thumbs up, let's go. So think about pulling your shoulder blades together. If you were really keen, you could hold two little, uh, one or half a kilo dumbbells in your hand. But this is get pretty burny pretty quick. Rest, Whew. two to go. Thumbs up to the sky, shoulder blades together. Let's go. Just a little pulsing movement. Keep your head down on the mat so we're not straining that neck. Two, one. Woo! Jeez, you feel that. One left, and then we're back to the start of our first round of back. Let's go, squeeze up. First back exercise, I should say. Straight out to the side, guys. Thumbs up to the sky. Lifting from your shoulder blades. Oh, feel that. Okay, back to our renegade row. So grabbing your two dumbbells. This will be our last round of back. Then we're straight into a stretch. Wait for the timer. Let's go. Squeeze up, elbows high, head in line with the rest of the body. Come on, you can do it. Go 
Okay, dumbbells to the side, back to our sea turtles. We're not gonna incorporate the lower body. We're just working the back today, but keep your glutes tight. We protect your lower back. Head stays on the grip, or eyes down, so you're not straining that neck. The only reason that chest lifts up is because you're pulling back with the elbows and using that back to pull up. Come on. Keep your glutes squeezed. You probably could add some one kilo weights if you're advanced, only if you are advanced at that movement. Back to our full complex. Tip, stand up, curl. So it's one row, one curl, hammer curl. Tip. Row, if you can't for any reason get straight for that row, just do a bicep curl is fine. Hinge, shoulder blades come together, curl. Okay, deadlift guys, next. So we're gonna tip, stick our butts out the back, shoulder blades, shoulders back. So we're going to hinge at the hips and we push through the heels to come up. Keep your core squeezed. Just come as low as you can. That's it. Ten seconds. Go to a bow if it doesn't feel good for you. Okay, finishing off with our back extensions. Last exercise. Thumbs up, head down. So when it dings, I think we have another 10 seconds. Let's start anyway, just in case. We'll just do an extra long round. Let's go. Thumbs up. Oh yeah, that's right. But lucky I did start. <laughs> Break, using your shoulder blades to lift up. Thumbs up guys, squeeze, let's go. So our target area is the back this round. Try to get your arms straight out to the side rather than back or forward. Great, woo! Two left and you're done. Two, one, let's go. Straight up, lifting from your shoulder blades or your back, thumbs up to the sky, oh, feel that, last one before we get into a stretch, let's go. Come on, finish off. Ah, done. Well done, guys. So let's stretch our back here. Let's pull back. Sit straight back into a child's pose. If you are a bit tight, have your knees a bit wide, a bit tight in the hips, pull your knees apart. Okay, option to come up, walking the hands around with this hand, pull through. And you'll feel it all down the side of the back where we just worked, hopefully. Ah, 
Okay, coming to the center. We're gonna come round to the other side. Pull through with that arm. Okay, let's come to the center. We're gonna step back for a calf stretch. Step back, other side. Stepping forwards, hip flexor, squeeze that bum. Glute tight, lean it forwards with the hip, arm up and over. Two, one, switching sides. Squeeze that bum, push the hip forward, arm up and lean to the side. Two, one, coming up to standing. We are going to tip over, stretch our hamstrings. Straight legs, guys. Try not to hunch over with the back. Three, two, one, bend your knees. Slowly roll up, open up that chest, stretch the shoulders and the chest. Two, and one, reverse. Tuck that chin around the upper back. A little bit of a release where we just worked. One, roll the shoulders back, two, one, and forwards, two, one. Quick glute stretch. We did a lot of glute work at the start. Foot goes on top, pull back. Great job today. So we got some legs in, some chest, front of the upper body, and some back of the upper body. Two, one, let's switch sides. Squeeze it back, stretch that hip glute. So you can push this leg away. You feel it a bit more down the side of the leg. Three, two, one. Let's bring it up. We're gonna finish off with a quad stretch. So grab that foot, so pull your heel, heel to your bum. Push your hip forward. You might need to hold something to balance like I do. Try and um, focus on something in front. Five seconds, four, three, two, one. Switching sides, five, four, three, two. Squeeze the back. And one, well done. Finishing off with our rotation. Four, three, two, one. You are done, congratulations. Proud of you, you have a wonderful day wherever you are.